taking a little walk down here to the waterfront. <gasps> Mama, Mama wants you. <laughs> she can go. <laughs> Oh, yeah, we should have bought a bag. Shoot. We can go back up and get a bag. <laughs> it's just like everywhere you go. It's just everywhere. Oh my gosh, yeah. I think we're gonna have to grab a bag and come back down here. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Wow. Well, it's still pretty, but yeah. It's deep, can't see the bottom. I right, see the bottom there. Yeah, it's really trashed out. That's too bad. Looks like they probably had uh, tents here. And then you can walk down that trail there. Bears for humans. The That's thing, how I feel. Yeah, it's well. It's shameful. It's just um, you, I just don't think people really think or care. Well, they obviously they don't care, or they wouldn't do it. But the view out here is really pretty. That's a pretty awesome lake. Yeah. I thought we'd go ahead and walk back here just a little ways. There's really no trail. Um, you can see the lake over there. You could make your own trail through here. Um, the problem is, is that there are ticks in here and I don't think I want to be brushing up against all the brush. Boy, it's a deep lake. Yeah, huh. we have uh, things out there to keep the boats to tell the boaters to stay away from the inlets. Yeah. Right, because there's houses there and people are swimming or something like that. Right. Oop. Touching mm -hmm. me. <laughs> Little things touching me. It's just a shame. Yeah. The garbage is so depressing. I know it's kind of been like the theme this uh, week with filming for you guys. It's um, it's really disheartening. I mean, everywhere we go and we turn on the camera at a campsite, there's garbage. Somebody made a comment that um, I ruined the video because I was complaining about the garbage but I don't know it, it bothers me it bothers the hell out of me yeah more it's getting depressing and it's really it's sad yeah and then for me I just I want to come back down here and I want to clean it up and then what the problem is is where do we dump it um, we find trash cans and stuff, but, you know, those places don't want to pay for all of this kind of stuff. 
you guys can't probably see down there. It's, it's not too deep right there, I guess. Yeah. And this is probably why they got kicked out. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. It's, a, it's becoming depression all you know. I mean it's just starting to just break my heart. Like, good God, people. Well, the thing is is, you know, wherever you go, there's always gonna be litter and trash. Yeah. It's I mean it's part of life. People, there's just people out there that don't really care. What do you think, Moo? So, mm. Where's a biscuit? Where's a biscuit? <laughs> I got no biscuits. Kind of bursted my bubble coming down here. <laughs> all right, well, as we were all just saying, that was really short lived. <laughs> we, um, we're back up in our area here. So we've got two racks of ribs. Got some rib rub on there with big chunks of garlic and onion. Well, I think I'm going to put it in at 350 with some foil over it. Alright, our ribs have been in for the last couple hours. Stick a peeky. Oh yeah. Alright. They are ready to put the barbecue sauce on. Ooh, hotty. Suckers are... Oh, look at those. Yum. I love that. Look at all the garlic on there. Yummy. Alright, so I have all the ribs taken out. And I'm putting barbecue sauce on them over here. I want to get it on the back side too. But there is a lot of juices left over. There's a pretty thick uh, layer of fat on there. So I'm going to let this cool. And I'm going to put it in the fridge and then all that fat will harden up and I can take that off. And then I'm going to use that uh, broth for something because it is yummy. All right, the ribs are all done. Aja is making a side dish and then we're going to eat. Well, I just went over there and woke Aja up. <laughs> Everybody was kind of taking a nap, but I have been watching the weather forecast and it doesn't look good for where we're kind of sitting among these trees and so we are making a plan to leave here within the next hour we're going to go 21 minutes down the road to a cracker barrel which has no trees around it they're calling for um, thunderstorms and possible tornado warnings with heavy rain so Atlanta's getting hit right now with it and so we're just we're gonna be cautious I I think it will probably miss us but these are a lot of trees that they're not very um, healthy so we're gonna go ahead and pack up and get on out of here well, I did pick up two bags of garbage. We never did go back down to the water. It, um, it's just so much garbage down there that we don't really have anywhere to put it. So hopefully somebody will come along and do their share and we'll go ahead and take this garbage somewhere and get rid of it. And we're heading out. I think we got out of the forest just in time. Tell Dad to get the cracker barrel. She's going to Walmart. <laughs> Where are you going? Going to the Walmart website. I need to get a couple things at Walmart. We'll just follow you there. Roger. This is what Moo does when she's waiting for Aja. <laughs> Are you waiting for Mama? Huh? Are you waiting for your Mama? What? <laughs> yeah, we're just an adorable baby, aren't you? Yeah, okay. Yeah, so she we, loves her Mama. We do the, the cope. <laughs> 
Well, not co-parenting, but we like having you over. Okay, you want five? <laughs> no, you don't like that. You just want, oh, pet me, pet me. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's all you get from me. She doesn't like it when Mama takes off, though. No. What do you think, Moo? Huh? Let's go find our spot. So, we are in the Walmart parking lot. We came down here first to get a couple things. Uh, we need to get water and we needed to get some oranges. So, we're going to go stay over at the Cracker Barrel tonight. Um, it seems to be the best place to pull over because if we go any further into Atlanta, it's pretty stormy in there, I believe. So, this is just a better place. And I am really glad we left that Absolutely. forest. Absolutely. So. One, there's no bugs here. Yeah. <laughs> the rain took them away. That other place. It's busy, though, in here. Millions of bugs. Yeah. So, okay, we're going to head over and set up for the evening and get a early start tomorrow.